Have you ever seen somebody with one of those handheld computers that when they push their finger against the screen it actually opens up programs or they take out what looks like a pen and they start writing on the screen and it converts their chicken scratch into actual text? Well if you have a tablet PC or you purchased a computer with Windows 7 on it and you got one of those fancy monitors that came with it, one of those touch screens, you need the software to be able to convert your chicken scratch into actual text and Windows 7 has what's called tablet PC input panel. It's a toolbar that you can find by coming down here and right clicking in a blank area on your taskbar then going up hovering over toolbars then over and down and click on tablet PC input panel and then when you click on it notice it's right down here on the taskbar to the far right when you hover over it there it is click on it and then give it a second or two and there it is if it doesn't pull up in front of you let me go ahead and click on the X you see how it slid off to the left hand side of the screen look over to the left hand side of the screen and if you see something there hover over it and it says what who me I'm like yes you go ahead and click on it and it's no longer shy it comes out and says hey I'm here to do some work all you have to do is just go ahead and take your finger and if this is my finger right here just start writing on the uh, yellow space just up above or take out your pen or what's better known as the stylus and just go ahead and start scratching up in the yellow area just above the line but since I don't have a touch screen I can still move my mouse up here and notice how my pointer turns into a little dot well, let me go ahead and try to spell my name. Let's see, there's K and C I R T uh, forward slash dirt. Uh oh, that didn't work out well, did it? Notice up here on the uh, tablet PC input panel, they have little buttons here that if you have problems with what you're writing and it needs correcting, deleting, splitting, or joining, you can go ahead and click on one of the buttons and it gives you a little preview or demo after you write the name go ahead and click on the name it separates it then go ahead and touch the letter write in a new letter and then go ahead and close out of it and it keeps running this demo over and over again okay also deleting just go ahead and click on it it opens up slice through a letter it deletes it collapses you're done splitting joining in any case let me come up here and close out of that so I come over here and when I hover over it notice how it highlights it in a box click on it just like we saw in the demo it expands everything and it's not the forward slash and it's not the D for dirt so to get rid of the forward slash go ahead and click on it and it gets rid of it but I want it a K so let me click and put in a K hey there we go if I didn't want a letter just click and drag through it and it deletes it if I want a new letter just you know put it in there and well I guess that's okay for the lowercase T or click on it to get rid of it try a, one of those T's Oh, now it looks like an F. Click and drag through it in any case you get the idea. If you like what you see, and let me put in my T here, there we go, that looks nice. Then the next thing I can do is I can go ahead and insert this text into a document, like my Microsoft Word document. Let me come down here and right click, go up and click on Microsoft Office Word, opens up. See my cursor flashing in the document behind it? Go ahead and click on insert, and let me click and drag the header of the tablet PC input panel. And there it is, Kurt. So then I can go ahead and write something else, right? And then insert Kurt, right, or Kurt. It doesn't like my name. If I right click on it, you can see it's not in the dictionary there. In any case, you get the idea. And as quick as you can when you're done writing, hit insert. And I guess if you're a doctor, that works really well for you. These tablet PC input panels. Just make sure you've got a document or a place that you can insert it when you're done writing in this little area here. And then one other feature that you can use if you want to be able to actually use the touch screen to type in the text. Come up here and you see a little keyboard. Instead of the uh, little writing pad, click on the keyboard and it converts into a keyboard. You can use your mouse. Okay. Whoops. See. Let me do backspace. Come over here and then space, space, and then type in whatever. But if I had a touch screen, I can actually move my fingers and touch the screen over those keys on the screen and be able to type things in. So you still got your keyboard if you need it or if you got a little chicken scratch pencil or stylus click on that and go ahead and write it in then when you're done of course be sure to save your work I'm gonna go ahead and close out of the document without saving it let me click and drag this and say no and then when I'm done with this go ahead and click on the X it hides it's scared now it moves out of the way so you can work on your computer bring it back hover over it click on it pops it back open now if you actually want to get rid of it then come up here and click on the tools menu and go down to exit and it's gone and then to get it off your 
taskbar here, just right click in a blank area, go up to toolbars, then over and down and uncheck tablet PC input panel, and it disappears. Thanks for watching. Hey, as a quick reminder, if you like my video, please give it a thumbs up. You can also click on me and subscribe to my channel, get notified of the latest videos, and for only $2 a month, you can have access to all my Microsoft Office training videos.